tornado forced residents to shelter in place in Madison, Indiana, before it crossed the river to Milton, Kentucky. Once it blew over, residents say they were shocked to see the damage. This is pretty good for this area, uh, involving a lot of homes, uh, especially during the time of day because we had kids trying to get out of school. Uh, we, they sheltered in place at the school that was on top of the hill. Nothing was exempt from being picked up and tossed around. Milton resident Mike DeRocher says his RV moved 200 feet across the street. It's a total loss. Hard to see. <laughs> What's the hardest part to see about it? Oh, I mean, just the damage, you know. Uh, work, work to get things like this and, you know, just a couple of seconds, they're gone. He says he was coming back to his camper when the tornado touched down. It's not his full-time residence, but it brought him closer to his dad. Well, that's my part of my dad's camper here and mine right there. You know, I mean, it's totally destroyed. Two people are reported injured from the storm. First responders were going around checking on residents while it was still light outside. There was no rain or anything with this first tornado. It was just wind and tornado damage. There was hardly any water at all. But tonight, this was a storm. Dozens of power lines are down. Even though there's no electricity running through them, Director Stark is reminding you to stay away from them. In Milton, Paige Barnes, Local 12 News. To get more stories from the Weather Authority and Local 12 News, go ahead and tap subscribe so that you can get notifications and get updates instantly.